All right, after my latest flat earth video, I gotta give you some fun content. So a 63 year old female with rheumatoid arthritis took too much methotrexate. What is the best next step? Well, for those of you who are screaming the answer, Luca Voran, you are correct, but why? It's because this bypasses DHFR and rescues the bone marrow in the GI mucosa. So basically methotrexate is a folic acid analog that inhibits dihydrofolate reductase. DHFR, this guy right here. And so if you have rheumatoid arthritis and you take too much of that, you can't generate tetrahydrofolate. And that's required for purine and thymidylate synthesis. And so synthesis stops and rapidly dividing tissues are going to be injured first. And that's why it's the oral and the GI mucosa. You know, she's going to get painful mouth ulcers and also bone marrow, pancytopenia, that kind of stuff. And so the fix is folinic acid, which is leucovorin, and it is a reduced folate that does not require DHFR. And that's why leucovorin is our correct answer. Leucovorin or folinic acid is a reduced folate that does not require DHFR and it bypasses methotrexate block and it just restores DNA synthesis in normal cells. And so that's why correct management of methotrexate toxicity is a leucovorin rescue, not growth factors or whatever else they're going to give you for the question. So hopefully that helps you diagnose this 63 year old sick figure who comes to your clinic saying, Doc, I took too much methotrexate. If you found this helpful, be sure to like and subscribe. Hopefully this makes up for my funny little flat earth video.